Where are you going? To have some porridge. Porridge? Yeah. Okay. Do you want some? Um, no, I've actually already had mine. I just forgot. I just didn't offer you any. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, if you saw the previous vlog, um, it's going to be making a horrible noise on the fridge, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It's going to be going eee! When we vlog near the fridge, it makes this weird noise. If you saw the previous vlog, Lucy surprised me with... Uh, we haven't even said yet, have we? Is this new? Yeah, that's new. New soy milk. Lucy surprised me with a trip of a lifetime, <gasps> and we're going away in a few days. Um, so we thought, why not do a little bit of shopping? So we're going to take you guys out with us for like a vacation shop today. Yeah. And we'll go around BGC. We'll say, what do you need? Bikinis? I feel like Swimwear. I've already got most of the clothes I would need, but I think I want to get a book okay. to read. Yeah, I want to get a few books. We'll go yeah. to the bookstore. Maybe some sunscreen. Uh huh. Sunscreen. Yeah, good like idea. A few bits. I want to get. What, I want to get um, uh, yes. like a beach Sunscar. top, because we're not into sun exposure these days anymore, guys. Right, it's over. the new us. We're over sun exposure. But I also saw a comment on the vlog. Well, you know, we did the eight, uh, the ten habits we've lost, and we said about yeah. not enjoying being yeah. in the sun so much. So it's so annoying, noisy. Microwave. <laughs> um. I had I actually saw a comment that said there's a lot of uh, vitamin D deficiency oh, in the Philippines true. because people shield from the sun so much that then they don't have enough vitamin D. Ah, so you need so a little like bit. I think you'll I think you'll always naturally get a little bit. Yeah, though. of course. Of yeah, course. that is true. See, it's like everything, guys. You read, you read the good and you read the bad. But yeah, we're gonna head out. We'll do some shopping. Luce, I want to get one of those. Um, it's like a. It's usually like in a color green, and you wear it in the sea. It's got like strap here and then a strap here and then like a kind of. <laughs> A cut. No. I'll put a picture on the screen of what I've got in mind. No, you're going to get the video. Where, where, <laughs> where can I find one of those? I'm sorry, but that's not happening. <laughs> Is it? Please. Side note, we've been trying this recently. A company sent us these peanut butters and they are delicious. Worth a try. beep out that word you just said. Sorry. George has like focused the lens and there's this orange light that you don't really see in daylight, but now we're in the dark, it just went into my eyeballs <laughs> when I and I can record. no longer see. Uh, anyway, so we're just finishing off our abacus quickly um, because, you know, shield and mask, not ideal. I mean, imagine back when you could stroll around a shopping mall with a cup of coffee in your hand and just be like... Nah, and nah. vlog without a shield and a mask. Yeah, but I mean... Those were the days. We now finish our coffees in the car and then we head into the mall. But we're going to have a little mooch around today and... Essamora. Yeah, Essamora. See what Jose's we see. parked up. See if we find anything. There's a few things we need to get, like toiletry wise uh, and that kind of stuff. But we'll also have a little look around and see if there's anything fun we can get. Maybe a couple of books or something. And we also need to get some other bits for us, some other stuff. But I'm going to finish this. I've still got half. Have you finished yours? Yeah, of course. How did you finish it already? Okay, the shopping's going well so far. George is currently trying on a rash guard um, because as you go, oh, it's back. So we've got a rash guard. I've also got some more goggles because I think there's gonna be a lot of swimming involved in this trip. Um, I've got some sandals. Thank you. Some other bits. I'll show you when we get home properly. Um, I'll be dead. It's kind of, see, I'm not even focusing because of wearing the face shield. So it can't really see my eyes properly to actually um, focus. See, it's knocking out because it can't find my eyes. Okay, I won't move. We'll let you know what we got when we got home. <laughs> Ended up meeting a lot of viewers who both work in this shop and we just happened to be in the shop and oh. Oh. Ah, that's okay. Oh. <laughs> hey guys. Yeah. Thanks. Hi. <laughs> Oh, and that <laughs> really sweet. George was actually um, trying on the rash guard, and we got a selfie um, with your rash guard on. Yeah, so. with the one that was too small for me and yeah. too tight. <laughs> All right, let's go. Yeah. Done? Yes. It's your coffee. Oh, that's done. That's done. Okay, so it's actually the next day. Last night we went to Quezon City, and we went to. Oh, you need to know how to say this, man. It's it, it's yes. so. Elias. 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 Okay, we went there for some uh, live music and a little bit of food and it was really fun. But we got back at around 11, 11.30 p.m., didn't we? Late one. We actually made a detour to Mike and Nelly's place to drop something off for them. And then we got back quite late. And it's now Sunday, so it's Sunday morning. And I forgot, obviously, we didn't want to do this haul of the stuff we got at the shops yesterday, um, last night, because it was kind of late. So we're going to do it now. 
That's only one of two, isn't it? You're gonna make That's a whole other one. Lucy asks for a coffee and then gets annoyed when I make it. I just, I mean, it's, I'm not annoyed for you making the coffee. It's just very bad timing for the camera, isn't it? I mean, this I just feel bad for these guys. This machine isn't that loud. It's quite loud. It's quite loud, yeah. It's very loud, actually. For, imagine, do you remember the old... Do you remember the old pod machine we used to have? That was loud. No, I was gonna say it made no noise. It was just like, mm. yeah. this is like, Bruh. okay. Sorry, everyone. Bear with us for a second. It shouldn't be long. I didn't even know the cup was that big. Like, it felt like the water yeah. was pouring for about 10 minutes. Thank you so much, George. Here you go. Can you whack it on a coaster, please? Okay, so we're gonna go through a few bits that we got yesterday. Are you happy for me to go through the bits you got? The first shop we went into was actually um, like a supplement store because George and I recently ran out of multivitamins um, and we got them from Healthy Options before, but, but they tasted really bad, didn't they? Do you remember? There was, there was such thick tablets. I think we said it in the vlog before. So we've got, so actually, we don't know how big these ones are, to be fair, we haven't even taken them. Done. You've just started! <laughs> so anyways, so we got some vitamins and um, there we got the Mega Men Sport for George because basically the late wasn't the lady so good in the shop, it was it, a GMC. It, it's, it's not Viagra. Just, no one thought it was, why? Just want to point out, it sounds Mega Men <laughs> Mega Men Sport sounds a little little viagra -y, doesn't it? Um, it even says performance, but no, that doesn't mean like... Yeah, it's not, yeah. It's not that. Muscle function. Um, yeah, <laughs> my muscle function's perfectly fine. Okay, uh, yeah, Thankfully, yeah, right yeah. now. Enough of that, stop, stop it. Um, <laughs> the lady in the shop was incredibly helpful and we told her our kind of lifestyle and she recommended these for us and there were so many options and... What? <laughs> sounding so wrong. <laughs> this is a multivitamin, stop making it weird. Uh, it's like, this is one for better for sports, so this is one for George, and it helps with like joints as well, and like muscle recovery. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> okay, and then for me, I just have one that's better for, basically they don't sell a joint one, we used to just have a joint one. So now we've got one for women, one for men, and they have slight differences, but they're packed filled with like vegetables and vitamins and good things. We're feeling a little bit tired at the moment since our vitamins ran out, so I think this will help. Um, and we also got, really wanted to start taking apple cider vinegar like a year ago. We bought a bottle, like, we didn't drink much of it because we made us feel sick drinking it, like the, the taste we didn't enjoy. So these are apple cider tablets, so now we can still have the goodness of apple cider vinegar, plus a load of other good stuff, but we don't have to actually drink it, so that's perfect. Um, so that was all from there. I love doing hauls, I think they're really fun. Let us know if you like this kind of stuff. This is such an exciting one, guys. This is the best thing we bought yesterday. It cost 27 pesos. And it's a green folder. <laughs> Basically, we've got a lot of paperwork recently with everything with the property, so we just wanted to have someone to store it all because we've got other folders for other things, but we wanted to get a nice new one in a different colour for the property stuff. Okay, so that's that. Um, then, obviously, we wanted to get some stuff for our trip, and I needed to, I've only got like trainers that I wear these days or heels. I don't really have any sandals, so I just got these sandals from Cotton On. 400 pesos down from 800, so half price, just like nice white sandals, and they actually have my size, which is awesome. I often, ha I have quite big feet, so I often struggle to find my size here. Um, so that was great. And then in Watson's, you know the Watson's song? I don't know the words. How's it go? Like, uh, Watson's. No. Look good, feel great. Do, 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 do. Watson's and friends. Wow. Not sponsored by Watson. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to hire us for the next ad, hopefully. Um, so, this is a child's sun cream. Uh, it was 50 plus and it's a water resistant one. So, we asked the lady in the shop if it's okay for adults to use it. Um, and apparently it's actually better for sensitive skin, which is probably quite good for us anyway. Sun cream, very important. Okay, then we went, uh, where's the next one? This one's good next. Went to Bench, looking for a rash guard for George. They only had, well, they, their extra large was small on George, because he's a big guy now, so. We'll get onto that later. But I got myself this in the sale, 399 down from 1-2. So, very good discount. It's like a dress, a uh, skirt, sorry. But it's like a kind of see-through, so you'd wear it, obviously like not going out, out, but you wear it around the pool or to the beach or something, just as like an overskirt um, when wearing swimwear. Then we went to Kiehl's, got some face sun cream, the uh, 50 plus high protection face sun cream. I just wear this every day now. I do like toner and stuff, and before putting makeup on, I'll use this. You guys know, we're not into sun at the moment. This is a very good sun cream, and it's very, um, very important to use it every day. 
And then we also got this lip balm for George. George likes his lip balm, so we got that. And they also gave me some samples as well. So we'll try them out soon. Uh, then we went to Speedo and got George a rash guard that fits him well. And this is actually, for George, it's a 50 plus protection um, rash guard so that when he's in the ocean or at the swimming pool, he, wow, our camera does not like black. Look at this, how much it washes it out. There you go. <laughs> um, and this is just good for sun protection again. Um, so that's great for the trip and any upcoming trips in the future as well. And I got myself, I treated myself to a pair of new goggles. And they're, they're really nice ones from Speedo. They're, they're actually also UV, anti-fog. Um, and I mean, I love swimming. I love going underwater and looking around, even in swimming pools. And my goggles were really old and scratched and they were super cheap. I got them in a mall in Illo Illo, I think. And they're just like done. They're, I've had them for a long time. I've used them a lot. So I got some nice new ones there. Then we went to Fully Books, got a couple of books um, for the trip, and guys, look at that. So this is actually a Tagalog learning book, and I've looked at these before in shops, and I always feel like I never really get on with learning things through a book kind of way, but I don't know why, the way this was worded and the way it was laid out, I find it really good. It's all like, um, actually how you say it in real life. I just think this might encourage us to keep learning, keep trying to speak Tagalog and just pick up phrases. I mean, we, we do try and we have tried in the past, but I just find it so difficult. So maybe this will help with that. Then, oh yeah, then I got a swimsuit from the SM store. And it's more of a swimsuit that if I actually want to go properly swimming in, instead of like a little bikini that will like fall off if I try and do a lap, um, a length, sorry. Um, it's like zip up in this nice blue color, 900 pesos. I don't think it looks very nice off. <laughs> Yeah, actually, it's a really nice looking swimsuit and it fits me really well. So let me try it on quickly. Wow, I like that. It looks like, it looks quite Olympic. Yeah? Yeah. It's good. That's awesome. And it's actually got a zipper. So, so it's got like two sides of this swimsuit. We were, I was <laughs> joking about it with Mike and Nelly last night. So it's like, this is like lounging around the pool and I'm like drinking a cocktail and it's like, a, I feel like I've got other swimsuits that look like this. And then suddenly I'm like, right, it's time for lengths. <laughs> Oh no, I'm gonna ruin my makeup doing this. And your hair. <laughs> <laughs> I need to tighten them. Ready? Yeah. This is this is the real Lucy. So this is actually me 99% of the time, and then this is me like on Instagram, like. But this is the real me. This is the real me. And also, Rick from the guy that we went to the Alabang house with, who showed us around that for Juicy Homes, sent us his little package. It's really sweet. I'm really out of breath from doing that. I'm literally exhausted. He's painted these little um, thingies as like a, uh, these little canvases as like a housewarming present for us. They're really sweet. They're called faces. They even have their own ribbon made. <laughs> I want that. I want George and Lucy or like the Juicy Vlog on a ribbon. <laughs> That'd be cool. Um, it's at the end of the hall. <laughs> I'm just sat here in a silk costume. With the label still on. With <laughs> oh dear. Um, is that it? Yeah. Cool. I have my coffee now. Hi right, guys. Is that the end of the vlog? Yeah, sounds like the end of the vlog. What do I look like? My hair is off the side of my head. I look ridiculous. I know. Thanks for watching this vlog, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. And we will see you in the next. What are you doing? I'm trying to get some good lighting. There we go. <laughs> I'm literally next to you and you're going away from me. And we will see you in the next Daily Juice. Goodbye, guys.